Hey YouTube, in this video I'm going to tell you why I hate Maxima Chain Lube Clean Ride and I'm kind of ambivalent about TriFlow, but I love Muck Off. But I'm going to tell you why I love Muck Off and it's not for the reason you might think. So the reason I like Muck Off the best is because the bottle is easy to open. This tube here is long enough to get at my chain at the place where I usually lube it and the bottle doesn't clog. The reason I don't like TriFlow as much is the bottle cap is easy to open so that's not a problem but then you got to put this little straw in you don't have to you can use it like it is but it comes with this little straw which makes it about the right height for this but it's a little bit too long so I'd probably cut this at least in half and then when I lose the straw maybe I can still find the other half unfortunately there's no place to store this on the bottle the next one is white lightning which clogs up on me also you have to you can't just unscrew this cap you have to push down with some force to get it to come off and then when you do and you try to apply this you get a few drops, now I'm squeezing it, believe it or not. There we go. It's very inconsistent how the lube comes out of this. The next one is the worst one of all. Maxima Chain Wax. I have not been able to get this cap off for the last several months. It just spins and spins and spins. I twist and I twist and I push hard and the cap won't come off. So if I bring it over here and really push down, it's still not coming off. This is garbage. Why they put both of these in child protective caps is beyond me. Muck off, dry lube, never clogs. This is at a perfect length and I don't worry about losing the straw. So that's why I like Muck Off Dry Lube, regardless of which one actually lubes your chain better. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to show you why I don't like some of these applicators. So the way I like to apply the lube is I like to, let's start off with the white lightning. You obviously shake this up really, really well, which I've already done. And then you got to push down on that cap and get it off. And then I like to just drip the lube in here and this is not coming out of the thing it's all clogged up this is what happens with this freaking white lightning this one I can't get the cap off of the muck off is great so I'm gonna shake that up and I'm gonna unscrew this thing and this is gonna go on there perfectly so you probably can't see that but it's going on really well this is great but once you take the straw out of the packaging, uh, there's no way for it to hold it in place. And I can't even get the straw out of the packaging. God damn it. There we go. So now I got the straw. It, it bounces off the chain. Where do I put the straw and not lose it? It doesn't stick back in here. Once I do all that, what I like to do is take a nice dirty rag. <laughs> I actually wash these, but they don't really come clean. And I just go over the chain and clean it all up. Okay, my last ride was kind of muddy, and there's a fair amount of grit in my pulleys. So I'm gonna take my multi-tool and take the flathead screwdriver part and kind of rotate this around to get rid of some of that dirt in here. I'll try to do both sides. So the other thing I used to like to do is take this brush and not so much brush it, well that's what I have to do now, is I used to like to run this between the cogs, but unfortunately with a 12 speed, you can't do that anymore. These these are too close together. And this this the device does not fit in between there to use it to brush get stuff out of there so I do take this and brush out as much as I can 
So anyway, that's what I do. And the whole point of this video is why the childproof caps on these things. And Muckoff definitely has the best applicator bottle. Muckoff Dry Lube, that's what I like the best. I like the way it comes out of the bottle. I like the applicator. I like how the lube is fairly dry so you don't get a lot of grease build up on your chain. Hey, check this out. Came up with a pretty good solution to the straw problem. I cut the straw in half on the tri-flow and put a rubber band around the bottle to hold the straws. Thanks for watching.